uh, as we have seen yesterday, we have come across these two formulas which I have already written on the board, which is uh, mirror formula, 1 by V plus 1 by U is equal to 1 by F, and one more is the magnification, which is uh, image uh, height of the image to the height of the object, or minus V by U. So these two formulas will be helping us to find out a certain given uh, numerical answers. Okay. So first problem which I'm going to solve you all, you solve for you all, is the example problem in your textbook. Okay. It's the example problem of uh, page number one seventy, or uh, just you can tell example number ten point two. I've already written down the board. So please have this question in front of you all when you are checking this video out. Is it here? So in this example 10.2, I will read out the question clearly. So an object of 4.0 cm in size. Okay, so they have told there is an object. I will give you all the rough diagram. Imagine this like that. Okay, there is an object. Okay, you know object is usually placed to the left side of a mirror. So right now they are telling object is 4 cm in size. Okay, so the 4 cm in size is given to me. This is the height of this particular object. Okay, so don't assume that four centimeter person and all that. Okay, so it is simply nothing but uh, imagine that is a doll or something which is having a height of four centimeter. Okay, so in that four centimeter in size is placed at twenty five centimeter in front of a concave mirror. So concave mirror. I'll draw a concave mirror right here. Okay, there is a concave mirror. This concave mirror, they are telling how much it is. Uh, it is placed at 25 centimeter. It is placed at 25 centimeter from in front of a concave mirror. A focal length 15 centimeter. Okay, you know the focal length of a concave mirror. <coughs> the uh, focal length of a concave mirror is to the left side not to the right side so obviously the focal length or the focal point this is the focal point which means this is my focal length the focal length f which is given to me as how much it is given to me as 15 centimeter okay so you all can see the distance is measured distance is marked right now is to the left side of the mirror which means according to my sign convention which we have learned yesterday it is the object distance, the object size is above the x-axis, so therefore it is plus 4 cm and object distance is to the left side of the concave mirror which is minus 25. Though this is 25 uh, distance is positive, it is according to the convention it is to the left side. The person is standing in front of the concave mirror which means it is to the left side of the mirror therefore the sign convention says that it is negative and also the focal length of a concave mirror is usually in the left side if it was a convex mirror the focal length would come out to the other side that time that becomes positive but in this case the examples they have given it as a concave mirror which means the focal length whatever length is given that is negative okay then after that at what distance from the mirror should a screen be placed in order to obtain the sharp image okay uh, find the nature and size of this image and simply they are asking you all what is the image distance that is v and what is image size image size h dash so these are the things what they are asking obtain a sharp image means a clear image a focused image is what they are asking you all so you need to find out where is that image formed that is distance of the image and what is the size of that image formed and what is the nature of that image now i have already written the formula for here which, that is the mirror formula so image distance and uh, image size uh, can be found out using this particular thing but then to find out the nature of the image we are going to look after the yesterday's last two points the previous videos last two points that i'm looking for that is magnification formula i'll come across it in the next part the first part let us find try to find out the image distance that is v i'll use this formula itself directly so one by v which i don't know v let us keep it as it is but you i already know how much is that minus 25 centimeter that is is equal to 1 by f f is already given to me as 15 centimeter but according to convention it is minus 15 centimeter okay i will shift this one the other side to find out the value for v which is minus 1 by 15 will be remaining as 
this. Don't get confused. Uh, negative sign is only to the denominator. If then there is negative sign, the whole fraction is minus. So this full fraction is minus. So this full fraction, it is minus over here. That is negative here. When I shift it to the other side, it becomes positive. So positive itself remains. Okay. When I solve this, that is by using my LCM of 15 and 25, it's 75. And here 15 and 75 will be remaining only as minus 5. And this will be 3. When I do the subtraction, it will become minus 2 by 75. Therefore, the 1 by V, remember, don't do this mistake, of V is equal to 1 by 70, 1 or 2 by 75. Don't not write it like that. But it is reciprocal of V, that is 1 by V is equal to minus 2 by 75. Then take this and reciprocal this way. That time V will be equal to 75 by minus 2. 75 by minus 2 will be nothing but minus 37.5. And this is nothing but my image distance. So I have found out what is the image distance which means the image is going to be formed much to the this side. Image will be formed somewhere this way. Image distance image is formed somewhere like that. Okay, we don't know what type of image but image is formed here right now. 37.5 this is minus 25 and this is minus 37.5 I don't know what type of image it is but this is the location of that image wherever I'm trying to find okay so half part of this problem is over the next part I need to look into is image size so over here I'll create a box so that you don't get confused so image size I need is this one h dash by h so I will go for this formula that is take only these two out of it which is h dash by h is equal to minus v by u so h dash is what i don't know let me keep it as it is but h value i know already that is four centimeter and minus v minus let it be as it is v already i have found out that is minus 37.5 again one more mistake which i can do is you write this minus as it is. That mistake should not happen because there is already a minus sign here and also V is minus. So rewrite them again as minus into minus so that it will become plus in the next step. So right now U will be equal to how much? It is minus 25. Okay. So right now it will be 37.5 divided by minus 25. That is h dash by 4. But I need only h dash. There is my Im image size. So this image size, in order to find out that, the 4 will be multiplied to the other side. It becomes 4 into 37.5 divided by minus 25. So this, when I calculate, I will get my answer as minus 6 centimeters. Okay. So this minus 6 centimeter is nothing but my image size. So after finding out image size, I have found out my image distance and this is my image size over here. So these two things are done. The next thing they are asking is about the nature of the image. Nature of the image. That can be determined using magnification concept only. So which means image size can I take out the formula for first one that is h by h, h dash by h. h dash is minus 6 and h is h is plus 4. Okay. You can see this will be how much? 3 2 is a 3 by 2 means it is 1.5. So magnification is minus. Magnification is negative. So which means that the image is virtual images real and in Minus uh, yesterday's note we have noted down in the previous video. The note we have noted down saying that the magnification is negative for a real and inverted image, which means that the image of this particular person is going to be formed here, like this. It is real and inverted, and since the magnification is uh, greater than one, 1.5 is greater than one, the image is bigger than that of the object. You can see the size of image size is image size is 6 whereas the object size is 4 so understand it practically what is happening here is this object size was uh, 4 and cross kept 25 centimeter away from the concave mirror 
the image was formed at 37.5 after calculating image was formed at a certain distance behind the concave mirror then after that we also found out that the image size is much more bigger than that of my object size it is minus sign only has to do only has to say that it is inverted image which is below the ground so which means that the uh, object size is smaller than that of the image size which means magnification should be greater than 1 so these are the things which you are noting down the object size is smaller than the image size this is 6 cm this is 6 cm and that is 4 cm and magnification is minus 1.5 though they have not asked you all to find out magnification if you find out the magnification is minus and it is greater than 1 you can confirm or you can conclude that the uh, image formed is real and inverted so this is the complete solution for the given problem in your textbook and also i want you all to work down the first example problem in the textbook as well as the question what is given in the textbook the questions which is there on the next page before the refraction of light those two questions those two numerical problems i want you all to solve and send the picture as soon as possible Okay, so...